Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius, Hi Sign. This is September weekly reading from September 22nd to 28th. And this is general, may or may not resonate everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest. So let's see what are the messages for you and what's going on. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. First we will see general, then we will see love messages. Sagittarius, what are the messages for you and what's going on? Some of you, you are dealing with Libra, A sign. Or Cancer, Water sign. Or Vogo, H sign. Some of you are dealing with Scorpio, Water sign. Under the deck, Wheel of Fortune, the Empress, the Hangman, and Eight of Wands. Sagittarius, right now you're feeling stuck. Maybe things are not moving fastly here. But there is a fast-moving energy is coming. Lots of communication is coming. Things will change into your favor. And for some, the change could be difficult but it is happening for your highest good and you will take your power back and you will be on your power no matter what definitely some change is coming for some and lots of you it is a very difficult change for you so let's see your reading recent past justice knight of wands and knight of swords in recent past you took your power back and you decided to cut off someone from your life and you had a lot of passion towards something and there was a communication between you and someone you had a passion towards something but you need a plan also so before taking action you need a proper plan then present chariot queen of wands and the hermit right now you are focusing on your goal or you are moving forward in your life uh, and you want to focus on yourself but you want some clarity in some area of your life right now you want to spend some quality time with yourself Sagittarius because you are in some confusion regarding some area of your life then future four of wands three of swords and death in future uh, you will be heartbroken due to some reason and there will be a transformation and lots of it could be a major stability issues in life uh, or financial issues or in relationship wise uh, there will be some fightings or disappointments or you both will be in separation for some not for all but there will be new energy within you after this transformation Sagittarius and the person involved in this connection could be Aries Leo Sagittarius or Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So let's see love messages. First we will see the mutual energy of your love life. That's it. So the star and queen of wands and queen of pentacles there is a passion between you and your person and you both wishing for this connection some of you you are dealing with aquarius and right now you both are talking about investing and equal give and take and partnership 
but there is lot of passion between you and your both and such areas so let's see your person current feelings towards you Ace of Wands with Queen of Swords and Page of Wands. I think there is passion. Your person have a lot of passion for you. But your person is a little bit stubborn. And they always want to create fun. And your person is juggling here. Maybe they are not serious about commitment here. But they have passion. They want new beginnings. But regarding stability or commitment, uh, they are not sure. They have passion. And Queen of Swords, definitely some communication blockage between you and your person. So let's see the next action. The next action, I think I am seeing one type of ending here to be honest with you for some third party involved here. There is a lot of drama is going and your person is trouble. Maybe they are doing it intentionally, Sagittarius. And one cycle is going to be end and new cycle is going to be begin here. I want to pull one more card. Yeah, they do love you but for some third party involved here, other marriage is also involved here. So your person is juggling. They intentionally doing it lots of you. Maybe you investing in this connection a lot. They know it. You always there for your person no matter what. So maybe they are taking you as a granted. So let's see your feelings towards them. So the next action. I am not seeing any action here to be honest with you. So let's see your feelings towards them. I think you also feeling stuck. You are seeking clarity. You want clarity. And you are also very attracted to this person. But some of you, if they are unable to offer stability, then you decided to walk away. Yes. You are thinking about to walk away from this connection. And you want your new beginnings in your life. So you are feeling stuck. Definitely communication blockage. You are seeking clarity here. So let's see what will be the outcome here. Sagittarius. See, a lot of trust issues, a lot of waiting game is going here. Stability and commitment issues. There will be some communication will happen between you and your person. One person will initiate communicate communication with other person. But a lot of trust issues involved here. Some of you are dealing with Pisces. Definitely Sagittarius you are feeling you are neglected by them. Maybe they are taking you as a granted here. Your person is intentionally doing it. And things are moving very very slowly in this connection. And a lot of waiting game is going here. Yeah. Five of Swords backstabbing energy. Right now you are feeling very very low Sagittarius. You have to take care of your mental health. So let's see what is the advice for Sagittarius. Four of Pentacles with her friend. Right now you have to hold back. At the same time you have to focus on your skills. Some of you, you are going to start your spiritual journey. So let's see energy oracle messages for Sagittarius.
all tied up yes so you are feeling stuck and your energy is very very low but you have to come out of this energy you have to work on yourself and don't to spirit i already told you some of you are going to start your spiritual journey so this is the reading for you guys hope it resonate to you please do share like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon then you will get all my video notifications thank you so much for watching and supporting me thank you